Hi, I'm Lindsay Crows. I play Emily Penrose. And Emily is the editor of um, a fine literary magazine. She is, a, she is ready to publish an article, which is going to go to press on Monday. Um, not very happy about it. It's, it's a, a slow week, you would say, in the business. <laughs> and uh, she receives an article from someone that she knows well, who's a really fine writer, uh, who's written, she feels, uh, the piece of his life the essay of his life, and she's incredibly excited about it. She wants to get it published for Monday. It goes to press on Monday. You know, the publishing house is all ready to go with this other article, so she tries to get a fact checker. There's only one person available. <laughs> so she interviews him, and then she proceeds to try to work with him. Uh, unfortunately, his fact checking becomes quite fanatical. And so there arises the central problem in the play, which is, uh, what is the truth? What is the real truth? Is the truth, does the truth lie in a fact? Can a fact be altered by a writer for poetic reasons and still be the truth? It's, a, it's an eternal question and a big one. And um, I love the fact that we're doing this play now because I think it's an extremely important question. So what drew you to Emily and to Lifespan of a Fact? Um, actually, I think looking back, Sam said he had seen it in New York. And he began to talk about it. And he was really uh, lit up when he talked about it. And I, I said, come on, let's take a look at it. Because I think the subject matter is so apt for this moment in time. And in a way, for our understanding the next generation, mm -hmm how they process information, what the value of information is. You know, I grew up with Walter Cronkite, you know. You trusted Walter Cronkite like you trusted your own father. You felt that there were sources of information where the truth was going to come forth. This is very muddied now, very muddy. So many points of view. So I think it's a really important question for every single one of us to ask. Where do we go to find what is true for us? What resonates as true for us? Why? Tell us what you love about performing at Gloucester Stage. I love everything about it, actually. I've always loved working in a small theater. The best theater that you can work in is where there are wonderful, hardworking, uh, deeply inquiring directors and actors, um, where you know the people in the front office, where you're close to the artistic director and, and what they're trying to envision, where you are intimate with an audience, and where you can feel an audience. That's, that's, that's one of the great privileges of working in a small theater. Lifespan of a Fact opens August 30th at the Gloucester Stage. Come on down.